there might be instances where the browser fails to load pages or stops working entirely on your Android or iPhone. If you've been annoyed by the same issue, then here's how to fix it. The first thing you can try is simply close all the tabs open and restart the app. If you're using Google Chrome on Android, tap on the tabs icon at the top. Next, use the three dot menu in the top right corner and select close all tabs. For Chrome on iPhone, tap on the tabs icon at the bottom, then tap on the edit button and select close all tabs from the menu that pops up. After this, restart Google Chrome to see if it can load pages. If you feel that Chrome is taking forever to load web pages, then enabling standard preloading should help speed up the process. On Android devices, you can enable it by tapping on the three-dot menu icon in the top right to open settings. Go to Privacy and Security, and tap on Preload Pages, and select the standard preloading option. On iPhones, launch Google Chrome and tap the three-dot menu icon in the bottom right to visit the Settings menu. Go to Bandwidth and tap on Preload Web Pages. Select when you want Chrome to preload links and tap on Done. If you've been using your ISP's DNS server, it may have been suffering downtime or could be overloaded with requests. You can switch the DNS server on your mobile to Google's public DNS servers for inspecting if it improves the situation. On Android smartphones, open Google Chrome settings. Head over to the Privacy and Security section and tap on Use Secure DNS. Select Choose Another Provider option and use the drop-down menu to switch to a different DNS. On iPhones, you will have to change the DNS system-wide. To do that, launch the settings on your iPhone and navigate to Wi-Fi. Tap on the info icon next to your Wi-Fi network. Scroll down to tap on Configure DNS and then select Manual. Tap on the minus icon to remove the pre-filled entries under DNS servers. Next, tap on Add Server to create a new entry for Google DNS by entering 8.8.8.8 and 8.8.4.4 in the box. Lastly, tap on Save in the top right corner. Restart the Google Chrome app and try loading a web page again. Google Chrome also comes with an enhanced protection feature that is designed to protect you against harmful websites. However, setting Chrome to enhanced protection can prevent it from loading certain pages that are otherwise safe. Instead of disabling safe browsing entirely, you can try switching to standard protection mode on your Android device. To do that, open the Google Chrome settings. Go to Privacy and Security and tap on Safe Browsing and select Standard Protection. Alternatively, on iPhones, open the Settings app on your iPhone and navigate to Screen Time, then tap on Content and Privacy Restrictions and turn it off. If Chrome is still taking a lot of time to load web pages, you can try to clear Chrome's cache and cookies. To do that, open Chrome Settings, navigate to Privacy and Security, and tap on Clear Browsing Data. Next, tap on the Time Range option to select All Time. Then, mark the Cookies and Site Data and Cached Images and Files options before hitting Clear Data. After that, restart Chrome one more time to see if it is functioning properly. Lastly, if all else fails, it could just be a fault of the app itself. Thankfully, Google rolls out frequent updates, so you can head over to the Google Play Store on your Android device or the Apple App Store on your iPhone and update the Google Chrome app to the latest version to see if that fixes the issue. Hopefully you are now able to successfully load web pages inside Google Chrome on your iPhone or Android smartphone. If you like this guide, make sure to follow and subscribe to Guiding Tech for more tutorials related to your everyday technology. And make sure to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.